A $400 boot reduced to $150 that is made in Italy. More on that in just a minute. Hey guys, welcome back to Mr. Sneaker Insider. Today, we're going to be taking a look and reviewing a Saks Fifth Avenue collection leather boot. This is going to be called the Brandon Burnished Leather Ankle Boot. It is exclusively from Saks Fifth Avenue. All the information comes from Saks Fifth Avenue. This is not a paid promotion, but let's get into it more. Right out of the box, this looks amazing. It is going to be in a chocolate finish and man let me tell you this looks absolutely incredible in person i love the finish on this it's a nice deep rich chocolate color it has a leather upper round toe lace up vamp leather lining synthetic sole and it is made in italy about the brandon brand this is going to be an exclusive only at Saks fifth avenue one of the things i want to point out i was examining it and you can see on the inside of this boot that the insole it has kind of like a marking. Now it does say it's new, but the box looks like it's been kind of uh, beat up a little bit, but it's got like a sticker that's kind of like ripped off. So for the sizing, you want to go true to size or you want to go maybe a half size down or half size up. And it needs no break in period whatsoever. For the outsole and the insole, really nice on the feet, no complaints. You can walk on this pretty much all day. So for a $400 boot reduced to $150, I would definitely recommend checking this boot out. This definitely is not going to be a construction boot that you want to wear to work you want to have this more as like a dress boot casual boot also the leather on this boots not really like tough is really soft very supple All right, guys, that's going to do it for the video. If you guys liked it, please give it a big thumbs up. Also, hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to ring the notification bell. So then you guys will be notified first when the next sneaker review, shoe review, and boot review will be uploaded here on Mr. Sneaker Insider. I will catch you on the next sneaker review. Until then, see ya.